What's up guys? This is the Brofman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the Italian States. So to round off up at last time, um, we need to open up some ports for trade. Um, we do have other alternate routes to open up our economy by taking back Naples for example, um, but it would be very handy if we could knock out this fleet blockading our port. And yeah, got a lot of firepower there in those ships. My concern is that they'll have much better naval techs than I do. <laughs> so I need to be really careful. It's unfortunate they have the weather gauge. Haha, <laughs> reinforcements. So really, I don't think I want to do too much manoeuvring, especially when I'm downwind. I think I want to kind of let them let them close the distance, realistically, because I need to be able to. I need to. I don't want to get into a uh, a line battle. I want to get into the merge and get my ships surrounding them as many of them as possible. So I want them to get to get nearer to me, I suppose. At least they start to get within gun range. Maybe something like that. Because if they start manoeuvring at a point where I can't engage them, I'm that's a really bad position to be in. Whereas this, it's pretty good. You may even switch to a chain shop. Under the assumption that they let you get close. But yeah, the reason why I love chain shots so much is I really like knocking out their masts. Some people can keep firing at will, but these guys all need to sail at full sail. As I rack. Just keep racking those broadsides into it. moving and probably not broadside if I'm going to start fidgeting with them like that. No, you will want a broadside because you're about to expose your... Okay, we've got a mouse down.
cool bullshit. Attempting to try to get inside the gap here. You drop anchor. So you get in the middle here and just sit here, firing chain shot at will. Cannons knocked out a rear mast. Come on, pivot. Steady to route, that'd be good. You fire chain shot because you got an attempt to. No! I oh, just missed the shot, but fire at will got it for me. Okay, you need to pivot away from my ship. Pouring fire into the enemy ship. You get ready to fire chain shot because you can. Oh, that's a lot of fire they poured onto that ship. Defo want to fire. Don't break, don't break. Ah. Oh. Should have just fired. Abu Abu Kerr. So you can get to this position in the gap. Come on, pivot. immediately so I don't lose a chance to fire what we have. I 
If I can just knock the mast off of this second ray, then... Oh, good, he came back. Come on, buddy -o. Fire! Oh, damn, I didn't mean to fire. shot into that second rate right hulk. Yep, good job of concerned this mast is. To be honest, you can keep firing chain shot to try and knock out the hull, knock out the last mast. So if you knock out the last mast, she's just a hulk, she can't move. again don't worry we've made a second rate wave and we've got these last three ships to help knock out the fourth so he's trying to turn This has been a... God, I'm probably going to lose Fama. But I want to try to get ahead of her. These ships should... Just tear it, just nipping at the heels of that big ship. Pivot this guy. Yes. All of you make all speed to join this battle. Okay, I'm tempted to blast a. Uh, chain shot now because uh, that's a it's a beautiful target the rear mast is gone there you go mountain of gold it's making good speed firing as she goes You're going to be going anywhere, buddy. Absolutely continue. Oh, you just pick her up. A ship that's routing, you can, anyone can attempt to. Uh, if anyone boards it, it's done for. <laughs> Close victory. Whew. But we have acquired some lovely ships of the line. It means we are no longer um, in a deficit. We can't repair anything here, but you are with your very poor amount of troops. Oh yeah, we lost the general, didn't we? Um, I'm going to siege them, and I'm probably going to do some of this. Just I'd rather have a smaller, more complete army than a giant fractional one. 490. 
Ok. I vostri ordini, maestà. Still not great. Okay, Bologna is going for more development techs. Okay, Verona, you might have to go ahead and skip. Oh no, the naval the naval stuff is a uh, strategic investment. Okay, let's hit enter. There, you pushed up too far. I forgot about the order to move you up to there. We've also got some raiders coming in from the Ottomans on the to the west. They demand Savoy for peace. No. Yep, I'd love to trade, but I don't have the money. Whoa, okay, that's not what I wanted at all. Okay, in which case... Hmm. In which case I will quickly take Naples and then probably have to charge north to, to engage them. I think that's my strategy there. I just want to know where my money's gone. Then again, I was never earning... Well, I was. I was earning about 10 grand a turn. I suppose that's what Naples is worth. A few grand itself. And then... The Ottoman, this Istanbul's probably worth about 2 grand itself. So that's probably about another 6,000-ish. A turn. I'm not getting. Yet. I will soon. I'll claim it all back. We just need the trade to keep flowing. Let's help keep us above water. Good. National debt. Have I got my policies? Okay, yeah. So this is something I've not done yet. And I'm gonna do now. Although now I can't do that. Not, not in terms of tax, anyway. I can't do it in terms of any of it. I can't do that. Otherwise, I'd have to cut the size of all of my armed forces. Okay, so. So these guys to replenish whatever we can. So them to attack Naples manually. So we capture it as efficiently as possible. And then I question whether we attack that army immediately or do we wait? But I think, well, you may as well attack them. I've got loads of artillery. Their army's pretty weak. They've got nothing to stop my artillery, so let's just... ...form a massive gun line. Something like that. Let's keep... Some troops here ready to protect the artillery. Because it is quite weak having them all in, quite vulnerable having them all in one line like that. Too bad about my howitzers. My cavalry can all focus on the Libyan Kogulu. are now also focusing on them. Seems to get within range of my troops. And yeah, they're shattered. Good. So let's march up our infantry line. Let's 
keep this on fast because this isn't really a super important battle. Let's turn firewall off for my artillery so we can push our howitzers up. Our guard infantry units can also push up. Good job we spotted that fire at will wouldn't solve this problem. Okay. Fire at will. Because this is a battle I just want over quick. in position soon. Those guys are waiting for a unit to come up. Drop some Karka shots on the garrison and units. Okay, then let's run these men into position so we can start engaging the Islamic swordsmen if they're in range some of them are so all my artillery to engage that fire lock on populace just sat in the rear Okay. Speed up time. Ah. Good. They did actually run away. There we go. I just want to capture the city with as little bloodshed as possible to try and get the income back. Lost two men taking Naples. Don't exempt it from tax, we need your tax. Good, four and a half grand. Let's take this army. Plenish it with whatever 12 cash we can to buy one more guy. So what garrison does Rome get? Let's move up and take Hizia Talat. Yeah, very ragtag army. Lots of gaps. But what I think I'll do is when I've got my cash in a better position, this army, rather than guarding the... Oh, I suppose it has to guard the mainland. So I would like another army in the Balkans to help knock out the Ottomans. Okay, let's go for a bit more of a conventional style here because they've got a lot of men. Well, a lot of cavalry that can be annoying. The only thing I don't use is, well, I think I don't use enough is the Fusilier's ability to drop spikes down, which I really should. The cavalry is going to pretty much sit entirely in reserve. Fire Karka shot, it's actually lands short. No. Okay, speed up time, just to let the. She goes all form square. Cavalry can't really do anything here. Okay, these guys can fire, can fire at range. Right? 
You will aim at those camels. You guys all aim for this Royal Cairo Infantry Guard. Ah, speed up time. Yeah, weak cavalry units, okay. To, to lose. Not really that bothered about this particular unit, especially when they don't follow my orders. artillery target these guys are especially now they've got out of their defensive position let's get my foot artillery to actually start to shoot at other things yeah thought you might be keen to push up, see if they can shoot camel nomads. Oh, this is where the bulk of their pants units are, including their deli horse, their um, Armenian archers. But I'm not going to, be able to kill most of these because our cavalry is a bit different. Okay, I'm getting mowed down at least by my, by my troops. They're probably not going to rout. So. Well, no, they might. Get up here and have a hell of a time. Let's change targets for a foot artillery to attack that dug in unit. Yeah, the archers king did come back. Come on, you lads. Get ready and aim and fire. Stop firing. That's my regiment, of course. Shoot it then. Oh, 
Good. You guys go back up. These men charging the Cairo infantry guards, and to be honest, let's just stop all my artillery from engaging. Opportunity here to mop up a few infantry units completely. I'm not going to get them, but we are going to get this unit. Good stuff. And these guys are going to make it, sadly. Yeah, but it's pretty decisive as we scrabble to try get our forces back up together. Da sinistra, in marcha. And let's send our garrison on to go ahead of them and just auto that. La vittoria è nostra. Avanti per il paese e la corona. Okay. So we've got yeah, research, research national debt. Don't go on for Bill of Rights yet. Go on to Puddling Furnace. Okay, now we're making money. I can reduce taxes and taxes on the lower classes a bit to help spur growth. Maybe the lower classes might have to stay a little bit taxed to help support the war effort. Now you're going to fall back the next turn. So the Swede. Fortunately, we don't have a we don't have a grand power block in. Yeah, obviously, yeah, obviously they were gonna they were gonna raid me a little bit. And the Russians are gonna come and try and steal my tech. But the next strategic investment next turn, I need to rebuild my fleet or strengthen my fleet and probably repair Georgia not Georgia, Naples government building. That'd probably be the best option, I think. Because my na well, my lack of a navy has... Now it's really starting to show. Early on, I can get away with it, but now it's really starting to... highlight my main weakness as a faction. But that's okay, we've got two schools, we're going to keep researching. Um, I would like Bill of Rights to upgrade my universities, but really I need those more. There, are, I've got more short-term goals to satisfy first before worrying about the research capacity of my universities. But now I'm pretty set on the fact that I want to go take out. I want to go destroy the Ottomans. I want to take all of their territory, which means I probably need to build some church schools. Probably as I advance, in order to make sure I'm generating the required amount of priests. Yep. So they raided me, so let's just send a bunch of dudes out to go finish them off. Altri ordini. Fix you. Get you back. So how much damage is this going to do? Four grand. That's a lot of money. Let's focus on upgrading some of my ships a turn. Because I also need to upgrade or replenish these dudes. Which 
just the marines for now. You need as much help as you can get. There's not a lot we can do about that. 26 hundo next turn. Okay, I may even. You go. Knock them out. Um, may even send these guys to go take Sarajevo, Belgrade. Not necessarily push into Istanbul yet, but just kind of grab some more lower hanging fruit. It's probably a good idea. Brave soldier, drill master. Good. So once Verona's done with lime juice, probably want to do copper bottoms to increase movement range and top speed. Um, the cost. Recruitment cost is a bit of a bummer, but there's not a lot we can do. Um, but yeah, looking at the timer, I think that's time to end this part. So, after I fix these, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for more frustrating adventures against the Ottoman Empire. Cheers, everyone. <laughs>